Recession of the gum is a periodontal complaint characterized by the loss of gum tissue in the immediate environment of the tooth, resulting in a bearing of the root. These exposed areas can be in turn acutely sensitive and they can create, in certain places, an anesthetic outline or even be the expression of a more acute attack. In these cases, it might be advisable to coat, partially or completely, the exposed areas of the dental root. Many techniques have been developed to correct gum loss, most of which proceed from graft of the mucous membrane. These samplings are obtained from the palatine membrane, creating by the same token a second surgical site, thus opening the door to complications linked to the second operation, bleeding, pain, tenderness, infection, loss of sensitivity, and many others. With the invention of allergenic materials of the alloderm type, it is now possible, when indicated, to recover and correct the exposed areas of the root without using sampling. Once the local anesthesia has been administrated, a small incision is made so as to create an appropriate site for the alloderm graft. Alloderm is a matrix of cellular collagen widely used in general surgery. The total lack of cellular components makes it a safe material, thus eliminating the risk of inflammation or rejection. When prescribed, the use of alloderm allows, in many clinical situations, aesthetic results that are impressive, leaving little or no scars. It is affixed with interrupted stitching. The gum is then replaced so as to cover the material. Some precautions will be taken to reduce the risk of infection. Antibiotics such as chlorexidine can also be prescribed in the days following the intervention. Whenever prescribed, the use of alloderm allows, in several clinical situations, impressive aesthetic results, leaving little or no scars.